Hey guys, you're watching Josh Bois TV, and today I'm here with Paradigm Investments. Hello. Yes. Hello, hello. Here yes. we are. We have Danny Parks. And Nick Costa. And they are some of my favorite real estate investors based out of San Diego, California. Always uh, active attendees at our yes. events, trying to connect and fund deals in real estate, and sometimes meet even, some great people there. Sometimes our alternative startups as well. Uh, today we're going to learn more about them. Uh, I've always been very impressed with Paradigm, um, but today I actually had the honor of coming to their headquarters, which is just beautiful. So I'm going to be highly recommending visiting the office and the CEO and the executive staff um, and all the team uh, to all of my investors and to uh, all of my real estate developers and entrepreneurs mm -hmm. uh, in the real estate field. Um, so we're going to kick it off by asking you guys a bunch of questions about yeah. kind of what you like to invest in and where. Um, we're about to go see an amazing property in a little bit, a $50 million vineyard. Can you tell me a little bit more about this project? Oh gosh, there's, I don't think we have enough time. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's actually one of our um, sponsors built a lot of Temecula Valley. I mean, wow. he's been around a long time. Um, he made it through 2008 profitable. Wow. Right. Um, Recession proof. With his, with his uh, little vineyard, I guess they would say. So his winery, which was just um, one little building, and he has an Airbnb attached oh, wow. to it also. Nice. Um, he, at the time, is uh, it's a wedding venue. So he, he was, multi -use. you know, multi-use. So what happened was a dream he's had for a long time, and it basically came together and we're involved in it. Um, it has different sections at this winery, which you'll see wow. later. We'll be showing you guys all that on the channel yeah, soon, too. Yeah, so um, right now we're, uh, they closed on Spain, correct? Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> and we're working on the Vienza side. Okay. So it's the Italian Type My one. favorite. So I love Italian it's, I, The way to explain it is almost like um, if you've ever been to Epcot Center in Disney World. Uh, probably. Okay. <laughs> so it's all different sections. It's a winery like that. Okay. They did a lot of studies and basically when people come down to tour the wineries, they usually hit about three different wineries at a time. Okay. Yeah, true. So what he's done is made it so you're not leaving. You're <laughs> going to, you don't want to leave so yeah. it could be because you have everything at this one property. Okay. So um, that's exactly how that, Wow. it's exciting. So we're gonna be giving you guys a tour of this $50 million beautiful vineyard a little bit later. But that's you know kind of just one type of real estate that you guys work on. Um, I'm gonna turn this to Nick now, who on the way down here gave me just a beautiful explanation of what Paradigm does, with all the best buzzwords and everything, but it wasn't <laughs> even the buzzwords. It was just well phrased, well worded, well explained. Can you give me a, the elevator pitch on Paradigm Funding and yeah, what yeah. you guys like to invest in, paradigm the strict standards? Ab absolutely, absolutely. So w so Ryan Garland is the president and the founder of Paradigm, and he had a vision to, to build a company that would allow investors from all different tiers to participate in high-level real estate transactions from an investment standpoint. And so... Whether that means going in and being a silent partner in a project that's already built and holding a note or having a small or having a return that you get monthly so you can get a monthly check, all the way up to being a significant partner like we were talking about. Mm -hmm. So a family office could come in and say, we would love to develop, co-develop and, and be a part of a $300 million multi-tier uh, full community where there's a hotel, a banquet center, a retail center, mm. luxury apartments, senior living, and uh, and some more land to be developed down the road. Mm. So there's a number of different ways that uh, one can invest in real estate. Whereas traditionally, if somebody thinks about real estate investing, whether it's somebody who mm -hmm. has worked at IBM and they have a pension and they want to invest, they might not have the time or the expertise to mm -hmm. go out and learn what it means to yep. fix and flip real estate. And if they do, they're going to have to navigate all of the different fees, all of the different facets of real uh -huh. estate, that sub market, the different types of the real estate products, whether it's, uh, I, I mean, there's millions of different things. Definitely. And so by creating this, this holistic team, we have 
all the different dimensions that allow somebody to come in and say, we want to participate in a real estate investment. We have uh, anything from you know, $50,000 $50, all the way up to $500 million, mm -hmm. and we want to participate on, on a partnership level with Paradigm Investments. Mm -hmm. We can be your, your steward, your, your shepherd yep. in navigating those transactions. And so Ryan has built a team around a recession resistant mm -hmm. products in the real estate space that offer different investors a multitude of different product types and different returns based on their wow. appetite. So there's timing issues, there are different product types. We were mentioned about that winery that we had mm -hmm. spoken uh -huh. about earlier. There's different phases of the winery. Um, and so we, we have a full team, a full on, as you see, we're sitting in a podcast studio right now. So marketing is just one element of doing, of doing real estate correctly. Mm -hmm. And Definitely. so by bringing in people like yourself who have, have a diverse background in angel investing and throwing large events with, with key parts of the community, of the investment community, it allows us to reach out to the, and, and share our message, share our vision, and then the people who want to can participate, learn more about us, and then come to you, they can Definitely. come to us, and then they can, they can say, hey, what do you, I, I've heard that this is what the market's doing in this part of town. Well, we say, well, then we can have an educational conversation mm -hmm find out what they like, what their risk tolerance is, what their capital involvement level is, what their timing is, and then we can come to a mutual understanding of what that looks and form long-term relationships Beautiful. with people in the real estate field. Definitely. Yeah. So, that's so this, <laughs> this video is also, this. I'm on both sides of the coin here with these guys. Um, I'm not only going to be bringing them real estate developments that are looking for investments. So for all of my entrepreneurs out there that are developers or trying to build something awesome, whether that's a commercial mixed use development, even some residential um, or things like this vineyard. Um, this is probably one of the firms that I'll probably connect you to. Um, they do national projects, not just uh, US based. They have some awesome international celebrity projects I won't get into <laughs> right now uh, with people you definitely know. Um, but also this for investors. Um, one thing that we're talking about on the way down um, is that they actually have like Reg A certification yeah. essentially through the SEC, which means that not only can they target accredited investors, which most investments have to go through, which means you make at least a quarter million dollars a year for the last several years, right. and or you have a million dollars um, in assets, not including your primary residence. You can't be like, oh, I have a million dollar home, I have a million dollars. No, you don't. Because right. by standards, they it's not reasonable to assume that if something happened that you would sell your main home mm -hmm. to use that million dollars or something and then move into an apartment or something. Um, so this allows people, the average ind individual, to maybe if they have twenty or thirty thousand dollars they want to invest into the market to put into something like this. And and you know, wh whereas there are some programs out there like Realty Shares and crowdfunding places you can stick money as a you know small minority. Uh, investor, you really don't get the experience and the trust of a team where you can walk in and yeah. talk to them. Um, I got to meet several of their, their members today uh, here from the CEO down to some of their VPs and presidents, and they even have a former mayor here. That was pretty cool yeah. to see you know, the, the hammer Doug. thing on, uh, on, on the wall. Um, so these guys really know how to protect your money. They really do care about the uh, investors. Um, there's several different platforms and programs here uh, to invest in. Um, tell us some other things about Paradigm that uh, our viewers should know here, for investors think? and for our entrepreneurs. What do you think, Danny? I mean, I think our biggest um, goal is relationships. Mm -hmm. yeah. we, we do yeah. care. Um, all of us have been through you know, some pretty tough markets, and mm -hmm. um, our goal is to, we don't want you just to invest once. We, mm -hmm. want, we want to keep it going. Yeah. Um, and we overlook and Every single thing we have cameras up so you can click on and see things uh, that are each you know each development that's awesome. so you can take a look and actually mm. see what's mm -hmm. going on. That's very transparent. That's exciting. Yeah, that's very important. That, that's very is, that's amazing because you know that, there's, there's you know, some bad characters out there that you know yeah. say they're developing and nothing's happening and you don't know till it's way too gone. I will say these people really do care. And I've had the chance to know Danny. She's come to a lot of my investor events um, and just been very helpful. You know, even if it's outside of the real estate scope, I've brought deals in different industries. She's, you know, put extra effort in trying to connect some ideals to investors. I appreciate that a lot. Of Thank course. you, Danny. Um, you really do have to see this office. Again, we're in San Diego, California. Temecula, a um, little bit north. Yeah, yeah. Temecula, <laughs> but you know, for the, for the general region, yes, Temecula. Yes, yes. Um, kind of wine country and such. Yeah. Um, but it's essentially, you know, 
not that far out of Orange County. You're going to be blown away when we take you. Oh, I can't wait there. to see this next part. We're about to go to this $50 million vineyard in a little bit. I think it might even be a little more. Uh, than that. Yeah, I think, no, you said the, the developer put in 45 or 47 million of his own money. He stole, Correct. And you guys are helping raise another 10, 15, 20, something. And it's, that's just on one section. That's it's, just on one section. It's, it's, and that, and, and that, that brings guys. us to an interesting point, too, which is, <sighs> which is we, we, ha, we very, we, one of the things that we hold at the top is the integrity of the sponsor mm. and the developer that we're partnering with on the project. And so if you have somebody like Microsoft who you go in, in to, and, you, mm -hmm. and you say, hey, we're going to start a, an app or a software company and Microsoft is your partner, you know that there's going to be a high mm -hmm. level of professionalism and a sophistication about that particular market yes. that's not heard of anywhere else. Mm -hmm. And so that you have the alpha, which is kind of like what you do and how you make your money, which for us, it's real estate investment mm -hmm. and development. And then you also have the beta, which is that insider knowledge and that insider piece that mm -hmm. Paradigm builds with its developers mm -hmm. and those relationships that are so strong in those micro climates that other players don't have. Mm. And so when you're investing in paradigm investments, you're investing in our developers history of that area and their mm -hmm. expertise. So that's one of the insider pieces that we hold value in. And, and really prioritize when we're picking our partnerships. And they, and they really protect you by, you know, really vetting developers yes. that they're going in, you know, getting into bed with essentially, right? Yeah. Yeah. By developing these projects with, because it's, you know, the developer can make or make a project if they're not paying attention to the details, dotting the I's, crossing the T's, um, and they, they're not really looking at the land they're developing on, there's some sort of soil issue or the, you know, production costs or issues or staff or liability issues. Um, there's, a, there's a lot that goes on with making yeah. sure you're, you're doing everything you need because a real estate project can go upside well, and we down. We have a strong back office. So. Yeah, they really, really, really do. I was blown away when I came here. Some of their their marketing and their videos are amazing, and I saw some of the story and some of the key executives here share their story here. But it wasn't until I really stepped in today and just saw the extent of offices and professionals and people in different uh, verticals really all doing their piece to make this an awesome, well-oiled operation. So I'm definitely going to be bringing my top investors and entrepreneurs to these doors. I've already made some key introductions and they're yeah. working well with yeah. some of my favorite uh, partners. Um, so it, it's good to see some progress and we're just gonna add more fuel to the fire. Um, what else should we uh, share with our entrepreneurs and our investors out there in the real estate space? Uh, be open with your questions. Be open with your questions about how your previous relationships or your previous investments have mm. gone and ask us those questions and be open about that. No question is too small or too big or too sophisticated. We would love to explore those with you and find and really and really navigate that real estate experience with you. Right. We would like to be your, your shepherd in the real estate space. Definitely. Yeah. And you can meet the Paradigm team. They're typically found at my investor events throughout Southern California, so whether that's Orange County or Los Angeles. They'll definitely be at my next big one where I'm going to have a couple hundred investors and planning at five, six months in advance. It's going to go big. I'm probably have the Orange County Business Journal there again and uh, a bunch of local magazines and press. Um, so I'm excited to give you guys some, some good press coverage uh, awesome. from the local media. Yeah. Um, what else would you like to share with our uh, global audience here? Of well, real estate I, investors, entrepreneurs. I think the big thing with Paradigm is I'm, I'm the mama bear. <laughs> so I've, um, I've been um, with Ryan probably, I think it's He'll say 15 years. I think it's like 17. Wow. So there's a history. Mm -hmm. um, and there's also just basically seeing the ups and downs and how they're handled and how the investors are taken care of. And I think that's the biggest thing is um, we, you know, people that are coming in are putting their retirements with us. Mm -hmm. um, and that's, you know, that's the key. And we need to make sure that... Um, you know, you can't say there's no risk. There's always risk to yeah. something. But the way we deal with every single um, deal makes it so you can set your money there and you're going about doing your day and not worrying. Hmm. So I think that's the biggest thing is just is just seeing because we've all been down, you know, a tough real estate road at one time. Mm -hmm. um, we know what we have to do now to Definitely. make everyone comfortable. And we want, you know, I mean, we want to go big and that's what we're doing. True. And almost every good real uh, investor has real estate in their portfolio because it's real. Yeah. You know, there's, there's, you know, all sorts of things like crypto and apps mm -hmm. and startups, which I highly recommend all sorts of them. And I'll make, you know, advice on those. Mm -hmm. um, but there's nothing like real estate where when you put money in, 
There's no, even it's if the there. market drops, there's something there yes. that you can fall back on and sell, um, which is unlike a lot of startups where if you're developing a product or something, even though I love a lot of, a lot of these brands I'm pushing, at the end of the day, this is something very safe to put your money in. Because even if the market drops, there's still physical property Correct. that can be sold at some dollar amount or used or rented or multi-use. Um, it's very safe and almost every investor should have it in their portfolio. And this is a, this is a great channel to go through uh, to make that happen. Um, for entrepreneurs or developers, real estate um, people trying to start projects, mm -hmm. what kind of standards uh, do you guys look for? If they, they want to bring a project to you, either for equity sure. or mm -hmm. debt, and they, these guys do both, a hard yeah. money yep. um, and equity, potentially hybrid scenarios on some projects. What kind of standards would you want to make sure they kind of, to pre-qualify themselves? What would you say, you know, don't just not come to them, but... Right, um, we know. like projects that are entitled. Mm -hmm. um, the majority of them are. Yeah. Um, we look for their history also. Um, exactly what they've worked on before. Mm -hmm. uh, we, so not to say... Not we, looking for first-time flippers, although no, there's potential um, for that. No, but we don't turn that away either. Yeah. I mean, we look at each thing, it, every project and each person. So there's a very personal, you know, it's not like going through you know, like a, a grid of, you know, oh, we're not going to take this. We're not going to take you. We're not going to, we look at every single person mm -hmm. and every development. Um, and we do, um, you know, do a little background on everyone. Nice. So that's yeah. good. Yeah, definitely entitled projects and a clear exit on how they yeah. plan okay. to, and how they plan to exit in various stages of the process. Okay. Um, and then all the, and then also, also the payouts to the investors, how they're looking to structure the investment stack. Okay. It's definitely something. So every deal is least, different. At least what they've considered. Okay. And so they, we want them to have thought that out. And um, yeah. And all different investment sizes too, right? I mean, yeah. I, yeah. I know I just brought yeah. you a I mean, relatively smaller project. I mean, they had $6.5 million in, and we're looking for the final one five. I think we just closed. Yeah. Um, but I know you had projects. Uh, what's what's the mean, smallest? What's the largest? Oh, my gosh. The smallest, I think, was... A raise for seven hundred thousand dollars or something. Okay. So it wasn't even a real big raise, but okay. it was a value add. Um, nothing's too small, nothing's too big. Okay. We we like to look at everything. Mm -hmm. I have some I have some other uh, this law firm I'm working with that I brought that luxury real estate Beverly Hills project for. Right. But we have some half a million dollar little guys that yeah. just want to flip and it's you know smaller return than the multi million dollar project we were working on. Right. Um, but you know, so, but I also have you know projects where they're trying to build like a theme park in San Diego. So yeah, I mean, I, I, you know, you know, people <laughs> coming to me for 150 million, and people coming to me trying to build us. railroads for 300 million. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like okay, you know, there's a little but bit we'll, of everything. Yeah, we will look at everything and see where it can fit with. You yeah. Know, okay. Meets our criteria. Meets the criteria. Yeah, and we were just we were just met with a developer last week on a pretty cool 450 million dollar project in in New York State. New York State. Mm. Yeah, so that's kind of Skyrise. Um, uh, a, a, a lot I'll, of different a lot of different facets to it. Oh. Uh, very very diverse. Mm. And so somebody can come in, they can invest in a, in a land development, they can invest in a hotel play, all the way across. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Wow. Pretty cool little so spread. We're looking yeah. at that one. So anything, if you have something out there and you're looking to, uh, to get it funded or you're looking for a developer partner, we would love to talk to you. Come and reach out to us, Danny, mm -hmm. myself, Ryan, anybody else on the team, and we would love to open that relationship and start that conversation. Where can they find you guys online? Paradigm Investments, plural. Dot com, dot com and that's P A R A D Y M E Paradigm Investments, investments dot, com. dot com. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. And social media? All the social channels, just search the same thing and it will pop up. Uh, YouTube, Instagram, LinkedIn. Yeah, mainly uh, Paradigm. Yep, absolutely. One hundred percent. Nice. All right. Well thank you guys for watching. It's Josh Bois TV. Um, coming, uh, signing out from Global Capital Network. This is Paradigm Funding, one of the premier uh, Paradigm real estate. Investments. Paradigm Investments. Well, you guys have Paradigm. You have a big they, Paradigm Funding. Par division. Paradigm Funding yeah. is how it started. Yeah. It's, it's on the signage, okay? But now it's Paradigm Investments. Still have that division. Uh, there's Paradigm Investments out of San Diego, California, specifically Temecula. Um, although they have professionals all over mm -hmm. throughout Southern California, definitely highly recommend them um, if you're an investor looking to diversify or put some more money into real estate. And if you have a project, whether it's luxury commercial, luxury residential, $50 million, $100 million vineyards, like we're about <laughs> to go see. Uh, anyways, thank you guys for tuning in. Signing out.